What time is the Venus-Jupiter conjunction? Venus and Jupiter were both be visible in the eastern sky about an hour before sunrise this morning, November 13, staying low on the horizon. In the UK, Venus will rose at 5.56 a.m., with Jupiter following close behind at 5.58 a.m. The two planets are about 416 million miles apart in the solar system, but rose within 0.3 degrees of each other. This is slightly wider than half the diameter of the Moon when viewed from Earth. Those who missed the phenomenon will have another chance to catch a glimpse tomorrow, November 14, though the planets will not be as close together. Space.com report, by Tuesday, Jupiter will have pulled away, appearing more than a degree to the upper right of Venus. Venus will rise just after 5.30 a.m. and should be visible for a good hour before being blocked by the light of the Sunday. Jupiter is expected to fare slightly worse and will be obscured shortly before daybreak. The conjunction will be slightly more difficult to watch in the United States because sunrise comes earlier than in Britain. However, the planets will still be clearly visible about 11 degrees above the eastern horizon. Meanwhile, those in the southern hemisphere hoping to catch a glimpse of the astronomical phenomenon might have a harder time. The two worlds will only be visible for a short time before sunrise and won't climb more than about 7 degrees above the horizon. What is the weather forecast for the Venus-Jupiter conjunction? Unfortunately, the weather forecast is bleak for those aiming to view the planets on Tuesday. The Met Office has forecast drizzle overnight and persistent cloud early on Tuesday, which might well obscure the planets entirely. Generally cloudy overnight, and although mostly dry at first, some patchy light rain or drizzle will spread east across the region after midnight. Minimum temperature 4 degrees centigrade, the Met Office said.